Hell yeah. What's up, YouTube? Today is a very special day. I was finally able to work with my one of my favorite dealers that supports everything else we've been doing. Got something special to show you here in the back of the truck, so come take a look. Look at that. Caleb Russell, 350 XCF, number 557, eight time champ. Back on an orange pumpkin, back on a 350, possibly my favorite bike ever. She is sexy. So time to pull her in the garage, pull off all my goodies off my Husqvarna, my stabilizer, foot pegs, all that good stuff with some mooses in it. And we're gonna go race it and break it in this weekend. Let's do it. Here we are guys, three days later, got the bike ready and she's ready to rip. So um, we're gonna go out ripping it this morning. I'll let me, I'll take a few shots of the bike, show you everything that we got on it. And then we'll go down to the desert, break it in today. Today's Saturday. We have the OMC hair scramble race tomorrow. Um, two and a half hours on a hair scramble course up there at the motocross track. So just gonna get all the levers set, make me feel comfortable on the bike, get the motor a little bit broken in, change the oil tonight and then go racing tomorrow. So here we go. Here's what she looks like. Man, she's clean. Insidious Design threw some numbers together in less than 24 hours. So I got her stickered up so I don't have to run temporary plates at the race anymore. Stole pretty much everything off my Husky. So I've got, still the pro taper bars. They're a little bit flexier than the neck ends. My precision racing steering stabilizer is on there. I even stole my suspension off my, my Husky. So I've got Pro-Line suspension, making this thing smooth as can be. Um, suspension only had about 10 hours on it. So I decided to pull that over so I don't have to do it over again yet. Uh, everything else is on the bike. Got my fast weight ankle savers, ankle saver foot pegs or promo billet, whatever company it is. Um, graphics, got the Bulletproof Designs swing arm tab guard. IMS tank that came stock on the Caleb Russell edition. So 2.65 gallons, plenty of fuel for what I'm gonna be doing on it. Um, bike is so clean, so good looking. What else do we do? We got nitro mooses in front and rear over there. Um, now you can see my, my other foot peg. As you notice, it's orange on this side versus black on this side. My last, uh, my last ride out on the Husky, I going down through Recluse Canyon and hit a big rock and bent my right side foot peg. I had that orange set from years ago and I bent my left side foot peg on them, bought the black set anyway. So just happened to damage the right side peg and have these together still. So I've got two that are in good shape, one black, one orange. It works for me. Of course, local company, Aries, the best discard, super easy to install. And I think guys, that's about it. I'm to shout out the Proline suspension right here on the rear shock. I think that's everything. I think that's it guys. We're gonna get everything loaded up in the garage, or not in the garage, loaded up in the trailer, go out to the desert and break her in, get her ready, get her ripping. So. Um, if you have any questions on the bike, let me know. Hit me up in the comments below and I'll answer them for you. And looking forward to racing some more and hopefully we can hit some more races than we did in 2020 here in 2021. Um, I think I raced, I guess I got four races in this year. Like we include OMC, so it's not too bad. Um, but next year I want to do a few more. Hopefully Sidra is able to put on some more races with what's going on in the world, as you guys know. But uh, yeah, let's get loaded up and get going.
righty guys, let's get to riding. First ride on the new Caleb Russell Dish 350. Look at that thing. God, she's good looking. Too much air in that thing. Yeah. yeah, my brake pedal's too low too. Here we are. Got my brake lever positioned properly. I'm riding for a little bit, feeling really good actually. So stoked. Yay! Try not to wear myself out too much today, even though I'm having a blast. So we can go race tomorrow. CJ's racing the two and a half hours too. Oh baby, Jordan. <laughs> sure to be a good pit boss. Oh yeah, he's gonna have snacks. <laughs> Jordan will have snacks for us. So. Oh yeah.
Hi, George, go up the wash. <laughs> Slow guy. Slow. Give us something to chase. <laughs> You're the hare in the hare and hound. Does this wash just keep going or do I need to look for a spot? Uh, just stay. There's like some forks, but it doesn't really matter. Just go somewhere. <laughs> That was fun. Probably a little aggressive on the bike for <laughs> first hour, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Exactly. All right, well, we'll take this back over.
Well, there you go, guys. First ride, pretty short and sweet. Only rode about 45 minutes a day just to break the motor in, get comfortable. But had a blast, this bike uh, and I are gonna get along well. Uh, had a ton of fun, excited to go race it at OMC tomorrow. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Keep your eye out for the race footage from that. And uh, we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll see you in the next one.